I'm going to be making a moisturizer, an overnight moisturizer. This is a moisturizer that is rich in essential vitamins and minerals that is great to use topically on the skin. This moisturizer contains the vitamin K. Vitamin K is known to clear pigmentation, good for dark on the eye circles, reduce wrinkles and fine lines. It is also rich in vitamin C and vitamin A, boosts collagen and also keep the skin clear, bright and radiant. So if you're looking for a homemade moisturizer that you can whip up and use on the skin and see amazing results in a short period of time, this may be the recipe for you. So continue watching. Now before I start the recipe, if you have not yet subscribed to the channel, look below. You're going to see the word subscribe. Just click on it and you are subscribed. Now let's get in the kitchen and start whipping this up. To make the moisturizer, we will be using some parsley leaves fresh parsley leaves and these are rich in vitamin A, vitamin C, vitamin E, vitamin K. This is great to use on the skin topically. It also is great to use under your eyes to clear pigmentation, dark circles, puffy eyes and eye bags. It is also good for getting wrinkles and fine lines from the skin. It's great for the face, the neck and the decollete. What I'm going to do with the parts of the leaves, I'm going to extract the juice. To extract the juice, I'm going to be blending. So you will need a small blender for this recipe. If you do not have a blender, you can also choose to use a grinder. So I'm going to be using about two ounces of the fresh parsley leaves and it doesn't matter what type of parsley you have. Any parsley leaves will do, whether flat or curly. And we're going to use about two ounces. Place this in our small blender. Next, I'm going to add some liquid and my liquid of choice is rose water. Rose water help to balance the natural pH levels of the skin. It's very, very hydrating and it makes a great facial toner. I'm using a tablespoon of the rose water. Pour this in and now I'm going to cover and I'm going to blend. After blending, we're going to strain. All we are using is the juice of the parsley leaves. So go ahead and use a cheesecloth or use a small strainer and strain. Now a little goes a long way so you really do not need a lot and all we're getting from this is around about a tablespoon of the parsley mixed with rose water. Now once we strained, take a look, here we have our fresh parsley juice. And this we're going to use to make our homemade moisturizer and you can store this in the refrigerator for up to seven days. Now let's move on to our next ingredient. And my next ingredient is turmeric powder. We're using the turmeric powder for its skin brightening properties. Help to clear the skin of hyperpigmentation. Also help to get rid of dark on the eye circles. Turmeric powder when used on the skin topically will give you fast effective skin brightening result. So I'm gonna be using about a teaspoon of the turmeric powder. A little goes a long way. You do not need a lot. Now, if you do not have yellow turmeric and you have the white, go ahead and use it, which is just as effective of the yellow turmeric. So one teaspoon of the turmeric powder, pour this in. And now, and now we're going to mix this and we are going to mix well. So we're mixing parsley juice, rose water, and turmeric. Now take a look at what I have here. Here I have some castor oil. And I'm going to use the castor oil because castor oil hydrates the skin, reduce wrinkles and fine lines on the skin, help to tighten and firm the skin. Rich in rinsalilic acid, which is great to use topically on the skin. I'm using about three to four drops of the castor oil. Pour this in. And now we are going to blend and blend well. If you do not have castor oil, you can choose to use olive oil, sesame seed oil, or even some rosehip seed oil. Now take a look, here I have some flax seeds and we're using the flax seed for the gel, rich in protein, which help to tighten, firm the skin. 
flaxseed is great to use topically as a facial scrub, a facial mask, or in our moisturizer like we're doing today. To make the flaxseed gel, you need about two tablespoons of the flaxseeds. You're going to pour about a cup of hot water over the flaxseeds. You're going to set it aside to form the gel and cool. And once that is done, take a look. This is how it's going to look. And then you just scoop it off or scrape it off or strain it out. And there you get your flaxseed gel. Now for this recipe, I'm going to use two tablespoons of the flaxseed gel. And next, I'm going to reach back for my parsley mixture and I'm going to add this to the flaxseed gel. And now we are going to blend and we are going to blend well. If you want a more creamier consistency, you can choose to pour this back in the blender and blend together. If not, just blend with a whisk or a spoon or a fork. And this complete our anti-aging facial moisturizer. For this moisturizer, it's good for the face, it's good to use under your eyes, it's good for the neck and decollete. I prefer to use this at night on my skin. I like to take about two to three drops, arm it in my hands, and then I'm just gonna press it on my face, neck and decollete. Then I massage it on the skin for about a minute or two. Then I go to sleep with it, and guess what? Wake up with bright, clear, radiant, naturally glowing skin. Store it in the refrigerator and use it up within seven days. If you have vegetable glycerin or vitamin E, you can choose to add a little bit, about two to three drops for a longer shelf life. And there you have it. Thank you all for watching. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to share. And I can't wait to see those comments. So comment, comment, comment. And guess what, guys? I'll see you all in my next video. Bye-bye.